Okay, so here we are doing uh, de the distance demonstration, the TFR4. I got a gold, a two gram gold coin out there with my friend Lou. We're having some technical problems here. So I got that sorted out. Something was wrong with this camera here. Anyway, so let me get show let me get a sweep here. We're at about a thousand feet. He's standing way over there in a the distance by the curved PVC uh, irrigation line. So let me see. We got the got the unit on here, the TFR4. We got it all hooked up. So let's see we get a we get a signal here. There's the lock. We're already starting to get a a signal to the two two gram. You see when I sweep when I sweep past there it locks in the in the center there. That little bit of a a pull on the antenna. Okay, so I'm gonna start walking. And then that way you'll see that as we get closer to Lou, he's standing over there with the orange cones. I'll stop. I'll stop along the way here and show you that we're still getting a signal. Okay? It's just really hard to do this without a without help They're trying to do this demonstration here. So there's a two gram old dos pesos Mexican coin out there where Lou's standing. I had him come out here to help me because it's you just can't see the cones from a thousand feet away. Now you can if you look if you look straight back there towards where the PVC starts to curve. That first curve to the left and then it curves to the right and then it curves again to the left. That's where he's standing. So he's standing with the cones. All right, so we're going to stop and do another sweep here. As you can see, I'm still getting a signal. Okay. There's the pull. You can see I'm getting a pull towards the towards the gold coin as I sweep past. I'm going to sweep slow so you can see it lock and see how it's pulling towards the direction of Lou. Now if I start going I'll keep him in in view there if I can but if I start going the opposite way now you'll see at some point and we're heading we're heading south here. You'll see at some point that it'll want to pull. There he, AC he's still standing over there. You can barely see him. But watch, watch the antenna as I'm heading in a different direction here. Watch how it'll pull. As soon as we start getting past, we're not, we're not past him yet. But as soon as we start getting past that line of bearing, the attraction is so powerful, even from this distance, and you'll see that the antenna will start pulling in that direction. Just watch it. See, there it goes. There goes the pull. Look at that. It's wanting to go that, that, that direction. Even from, about, even from about 700 feet away. It's pulling. It's pulling towards Lou. Okay, so we're going to go back the other way. And you'll see that the TFR-4 is going to want to pull that way again. There we go. It's pulling towards the gold coin. I'm going to take it off that line of bearing. So I'm going to, hopefully nothing's going to go wrong here, so I don't have to stop the, the video from rolling. And you can see, I'm heading back in that direction. I'm going to try to get Lou to hold those orange cones up. Hey! Hold the cones up! Okay, good! Looks like you heard me. He has a little trouble here. <laughs> okay, so here we are. We're heading back in that direction. Hopefully you can see him. Way over there in the back. Over there by the curve. 
because that's the whole purpose of this demonstration to show that I'm not cutting the film I'm not editing I'm just doing a straight line of bearing from a thousand feet and we did have some technical difficulties but we're back rolling here okay and he's starting to come more into view I'm gonna take another sweep here in a minute so demonstrating the uh, the incredible power of the TFR4 electronic long-range frequency locator new uh, new long-range locator at the treasure finding rods company we just came out with it we finally got we finally got it all all the bugs worked out and we got it we're getting it going in production now okay so here you can see him standing back there all right you see him standing there with the cones now I'm going to take another another sweep here so you can see we're still getting a signal there's as I sweep past Lou you see the antenna pulling in that direction towards the gold coin try to sweep a little bit slower it's just really hard to hold this and then hold the camera at the same time you can see that the TFR4 you can see it's pulling it's pulling in that direction so let's keep walking get a better grip on the camera okay we're getting closer to Lou and as we get up up there by him I'll show you that the gold coin is there He's starting to come more into view now. Now it's kind of hard to hold this locator balance as I'm walking holding the camera, but I'm doing the best that I can to finish this demonstration. We were at a thousand feet when we started filming. So we're gonna take another, we're gonna take another quick sweep here. You can hold the, hold the cones up a little bit. Perfect. All right, so we're going to sweep past. There's the lock. See? See the pull? As I go past him, see how the antenna wants to pull towards him? Now, if I shut the... If I shut this thing off... Go ahead and shut it off real quick. I'm going to shut it off. You see it's on now. I'm going to shut it off. Okay, it's off. Now watch. So now we do a sweep. Now now there's nothing. Now why, why all of a sudden is there nothing? No signal. Because the thing's off. So there you go. This isn't something that I'm... There's no trickery involved here. Okay, so we turn, we turn on the TFR4, we turn it back on, okay, there's our voltage. For some reason, there's interference with reading the, with the camera screen reading the voltage, I don't know why, it was working fine yesterday. Okay, so, we're still on 2 grams, there we go. Okay, so now it's turned on again, and so now watch as I sweep past him. We get a pull. All right, so let's keep walking. I just wanted to give a quick little demo there and how, how the unit, you turn it on and off and you get a signal and you, you don't get it. Okay, we're getting close to Lou. All right, you can, that's good. You can hold them the way you're holding them. You can actually, Lou, you can just set them down there by the gold coin the way I had them before. My hand's starting to hurt from holding this thing. Okay. Yeah, so we're almost done. So anyway, we got a sweep here. You can see, I mean, we have a signal lock, not a sweep. I'm doing a sweep. You can see that it's pulling towards the gold coin. 
And I'm going to get right up on there and you'll see the gold coin. Yeah, you should have heard the uh, the noise yesterday from that band over there. <laughs> okay, it sounds good. All right, so you see I'm sweeping. And there's the pull. There's the pull towards the gold coin. Okay. Do me a favor and stand over to the right a little bit cuz I'm going to Okay, great. I'm going to show how when I when we walk past this, it's going to pull towards the coin. So there it goes. It's pulling towards the gold coin. Now if I walk the other direction. There it goes. Okay, I'm going to go back to the house. Okay. Ooh, I'm filming. Oh, okay. You don't need me anymore. Got that. Anyway. Okay, I'm, I'm... Okay. So, you can see here, there's the gold coin. And you can see that that's what I'm picking up on right there. Okay, a guy, Lou, that was helping me kind of interjected in the video here and kind of messed things up, but I'm going to show the coin from close up here. I'm going to try at least. There's the gold coin. I'll try to show it. Okay, there's the there's the, the two peso Mexican gold coin that the TFR4 was picking up on from a thousand feet away. So there's the other side of it. You can see. Just a second. Okay, you can see. You can see that it's a dos pesos about two grams. That's about as clear as I can get it. So we'll set it back here. Okay.